What is going on YouTube? Hope you're having a great day. So in this video, we're talking six tips for affiliate marketing. Welcome back to the channel, everyone. My name is Thomas. I make videos showing you guys different ways to make money online, how to carve your own path to financial freedom and fulfillment, if that's of interest. Jump down, posting here every single day. So we're talking affiliate marketing in this video. I have a ton of videos on affiliate marketing on my channel. If you guys have been following, if you haven't, um, we got two different playlists. I have affiliate marketing training playlist, which is like kind of like a crash course, like everything you need to know. Um, and then I have an affiliate marketing playlist where every affiliate marketing video like this one that I have that's related to affiliate marketing, I'll just throw in that playlist. And so it has so much more uh, videos, um, maybe like following more in depth and different types of videos than the training exactly has. But here we go, here we go, we're six tips for affiliate marketing. So what I want to say is I'm gonna go through tips one through six, and then if you guys make sure you stick around to the end, because I'm also gonna give out a bonus that I just thought of after I kind of already planned out this video, kind of planned this out, thought about it, and I was like, wait a second, there's something else that I'm doing that I'm starting to see now that actually has some serious value. So I was like, let me share it with you guys, and you know, uh, I thought it would be really, really cool to throw in. So make sure you stick around to the end to see that, okay. So number one, number one we are going to start with here is I recommend, I'm just gonna write like little words or phrases on the board here because I'll talk about that, but just so you can kind of visualize it. I, I like the board. Now, let me know in the comments definitely if, if you like the board because I kind of have this setup where I got a light behind the camera. So I think it's decent lighting, but I can always change that. I can use like two lights if I have another one if I want. But the board looks cool. And instead of me just sitting here like this, and saying, okay, number one is starting for free. You know, I, you know, here we go. We got the board. You guys can visualize it, screenshot it if you want, or you know, at some point, you know, whatever. So it's free. So starting for free is what I is what I recommend. Now, people who who ask me, I get DMs. Actually, people, someone just DM me, you know, the other day, and, and they were like, you know, to ask me about affiliate marketing, and I was trying to, you know, explain there. They said, how much money do you need to start affiliate marketing? And you know, I was like, you know, realistically, you know, you don't need money to start affiliate marketing, and I don't recommend it because if you spend money to start affiliate marketing. It's it's tough. It's it's very tough um, to become an affiliate where you don't have your own product, where you're not making the full commission. Essentially, like if it's your own product and you sell it for a hundred bucks and someone buys it through like PayPal or Stripe, you're getting paid a hundred bucks. I don't know whatever. There's like fees and whatever, but like you're essentially getting paid a hundred bucks. If you know someone buys, if you sell an affiliate product through wherever ClickBank or something. Um, you, and you get like 75%, you know, you're getting 75 bucks, maybe there's fees or whatever there is, you know, uh, taxes and all that crap, you know, so, so you're getting 75 bucks, right? And so it's tougher to scale that with paid ads because now you have a less, you have less room to kind of spend money to get that next sale, you know, whereas if it's your own product, it's a lot easier because you're not, you know, getting a commission, you're taking that whole price, you know, you know what I mean? So I say start free. And so where where do you where do, where do you start free? How do you do that? Well, starting for free for me, I would I recommend, and I even you know wrote back in the DM and I said, okay, well, number one, what you want to do is is there's places like YouTube, there's places like Facebook groups, yeah, Facebook itself, you know, more Facebook groups these days, um, Instagram, um, Quora, um, Pinterest. There's all these different things, all these different platforms that you can use. Um, where you can grow a following, grow a page. It doesn't have to be you. It could just be, if you're into fitness, grow a fitness page. You know, make put fitness tips on there. You know, culminate other fitness pictures, videos, whatever, um, advice. And and there you go. They're starting for free. Have affiliate links in your descriptions. Um, use something like Linktree. Like I even use this because it makes it easier for my link in my bio. Because I, I want to put my YouTube videos there. At the same time, you know, I also have a couple other things that I think are of value that I want to put in there, um, and some do end up becoming affiliate links. So that's why I want to have that there, just so that you can monetize the platform a little bit more. And so that's something that you know makes sense. Okay. So number two, guys. Number two is actually going to be start with a low ticket. Now, why do I say that? Because I would recommend high ticket. Right, high ticket affiliate marketing. You hear a lot of people talking about high ticket affiliate marketing, and, and, and high ticket affiliate marketing really, you know, is how you can make a lot of money with affiliate marketing. Because if you sell a product for, you know, a thousand, if you sell a, a product that's a thousand dollars, and you're going to get fifty percent commissions, it's five hundred shot right there. Boom. You know, that's big. It's like a big size commission, right? And, that, and it's like, all right, well, okay. You know, all I got to do is sell, you know, six, seven, eight more of these, and you know, we're looking at a decent income here, you know. And so that's that's the that's the, the the appeal, that's the pull towards high ticket affiliate marketing. But I say low ticket here because when you're starting out, right, 
especially using free traffic, it's going to be tough, right? It's going to be tough to get those sales because people are not going to want to spend, if you recommend products, and if someone doesn't really know you too well, it, or your brand or whatever account you're doing, you're using, they're not going to want to go through and they're, they're most likely not going to buy a thousand dollar product, you know, first shot, first thing that they see, right? So coming in and, and, and offering a cheap product, maybe a lower ticket, maybe like a $10, $15, you know, $100 or less. When I say low ticket, $100 or less um, is where you want to start because there's, there's a much higher chance that you can convert somebody to actually buying something when you know your product is $100 or less. Okay, And so this leads me to the next step. And number three is actually recurring. So you want recurring products. Okay, recurring, the reason why obviously makes sense here, if you're starting with low ticket, let's say, you know, a $30 product, okay, but let's say it's recurring, okay, recurring really just means that someone who buys it is going to get charged every month, and so if someone gets charged every month for this product, but you're getting that commission every month because you're still the, you know, the affiliate, and then that, the way the program is set up, you're getting a commission every month, that's, that's awesome, you know. You did the work once. You did, you know, did the work once. Um, you, you sold a low ticket product that was recurring. Boom! You know, now you're making monthly income for the for the work you did to re to get that first customer. And now that customer's on the program. The customer is here, and you're you're set because you don't have to worry anymore because now that's coming in every month as long as that customer is using the service, using the platform, using the product that you refer to them. So that's why recurring is awesome. Okay. Number four, I want to move on to here um, is is actually look past clickbank okay look past click i'll put cb okay look beyond clickbank because clickbank right is a place i recommend if you don't really know too much about affiliate marketing you don't know where to find products clickbank.com is a great place to start there's tons of products on there but there's a lot of also products on there that are crappy um, that don't get the that that kind of give clickbank more of like the scammier name even though it's not it, it it has great there's great stuff on there and and if you want to launch a product it's probably one of the best places or one of the first places you could probably go um, to launch something because it's a good you know there's a lot of people on there that use the platform right but Look, look past it, right? Look to other affiliate programs. There's other affiliate programs. Look to things you already use. If you already use email marketing, like for me, I use GetResponse. If I already use GetResponse, I use email marketing software. Hey, you know what, GetResponse, hey, they have, they have their own affiliate program, boom, you know, just like that. And I put the link down below because I use it, right? I, look, I use it. Also, look to other products or services that you've bought, courses or something like that. And many times, many times, these people who have these courses will put will, will have an affiliate program because it, it's it's like a win win, you know. If if they can have you sell their product for them, you know, and they don't have to spend any money on ads, they'll do that all day and they'll pay you big time commissions. And so, if you have buy a course or a product or something, for example, I have some link down below that I've either bought or can stand behind, right? Um, and so what I do with those is those are you know just court. They're not through ClickBank. They're through someone else's own affiliate program, right? And through that affiliate program, there's a potential to earn more commissions or higher commissions because those products are generally more expensive, um, and there's a lot of you know commissions to be made from those types of products. So that's why I say look beyond ClickBank. There's so many affili affiliate programs. Almost like like every everybody's got an affiliate program. I, I just made a video a couple of days ago about Fiverr, how they have affiliate programs. I said Amazon, and in the recent video I was talking about Amazon. You know, there's so many different affiliate programs you can use, and so you don't have to be stuck. To ClickBank or Max Bounty or all these these all these sites that like I've talked about on the channel. There's other there's other things. Okay, number five is email. Now, what does that mean? I don't mean email in a sense of sending emails to make money. Well, yes, you can do that, um, and that's part of email. But email marketing in general, I'm going to kind of broaden this out to say building an email list and then doing email marketing. So, why do I say that? Well, guys, it's it's pretty simple here. If somebody comes through, potentially comes through, who may be interested in the product that you have to offer, right? Through one of these steps, um, maybe you're driving free traffic, and then you know whatever happens, right? But they don't buy it, you know? Well, it stinks. They didn't buy it, and so you don't get a commission, right? That, that's all that happens, okay? So you didn't get a commission, which stinks, and they didn't buy it, but maybe they do need it. Maybe, maybe that product is going to help them, you know? They, but they don't know it yet, right? So what you can do is you can offer. 
to take their email in, re in return for something for free. Now this is a little bit more advanced for someone who's a beginner, but for those who, who do understand this, this is, this, is, this is a key key component to affiliate marketing. If you can take somebody's email for free and say, hey, I'll give you a free copy of this cheat sheet or I'll give you a free video training, I'll show you this, blah, 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 whatever it is, whatever it is, I'll give you a free you know, 10 minute consultation call for something, who knows, right? Um, if they put their email down and then now you have their email which you can follow up with additional things so now what you can do is you can follow up and say hey you know um, you know I know you're interested in this product you know here's what it had here are the features it has here are and then the next day you can send them an email saying oh look at all these customer reviews it has the next day you can send a video or a link them to maybe a video of somebody using it or you using it yourself something like that and then maybe like a week a week later so you know, they, they came through, they didn't buy it, but a week later, they say, wow, this is pretty cool, I wanna buy it. Boom, you know, now you just made money a week, it was a week later, yes, sure, but you know what, you still made that sale, which you wouldn't have made, maybe someone else would have made it down the road, but now you got that sale because you had them on your email list and you were able to email market to them and that's why, you know, that's big. But now what I will say here is this leads me to number six, um, and so six is bonuses. So what does that mean, and what is like what am I saying about bonuses? Well, when I when I say bonuses, it, it means offering bonuses to stand out. Now, okay, yes, like like I said before, you can have a free a free something. Hey, I'm giving away a free cheat sheet if you sign up for my email list, or, or I'm giving away a free cheat sheet. Enter your email, I'll send you the cheat sheet, and then go to my go to the product. That's what you can send them to. You can go from the free traffic to the email uh, opt in where they get the cheat sheet if they opt in. Okay, boom. So that's kind of an example of a bonus, right? That's a bonus. Or what you could do, what many people do do, is is what you can do is offer a bonus, saying if you buy through my affiliate link, if you buy this product through me, right? What I can do for you is I can give you this as well. And so that's where you can then offer. Maybe that's that's one one aspect. Maybe okay, I'll give you a free video training. Okay, I'll give you a free cheat sheet. Oh, I'll I'll give you a free product. You know, something like that. And boom, you know, just like that, you know, you can you can seriously do pretty well uh, because now you're standing out. So if someone wants to get this product, this this low ticket or recurring product or whatever product it is, if someone wants this product but like so many people are promoting it, it's a very common product, right? How do you stand out? Well, you offer bonuses and you stand out and use those bonuses to differentiate yourself from the crowd. Okay, does that make sense? Now, what I will say is that now we are on to number six, and so we've hit the bonus right now i want to share a bonus tip with you guys and so what i wanted to share is actually the bonus that i'm going to share with you guys is actually going to be something right here it's going to be it's going to be facebook chatbots now what is that do you you know maybe you've started to hear a little bit about facebook chatbots but what i wanted to talk about guys was the power of chatbots okay so what I'm going to recommend is is maybe something like ManyChat. There's other chatbots out there. I use ManyChat myself. What you can do, just look it up. You can get it for free, and you can start for free. And so, with ManyChat, you have the ability. It's similar to um, to opting in an email. So you can have places where someone can click on a link, and then they click on that link, and then it'll automate a message from your page, right? So now you can have a, a, a Facebook page. It has to be like a business page. Um, so it could just be your name. It could be whatever. For me, I use my name. I have my own Facebook page. If you guys don't know, <laughs> and so you can use that, and and through that, it could just be you can have someone click a link, right? And the link will go to maybe it'll say, hey, how's it going? Whatever your name is, um, are you interested in this? Blah blah blah. And then maybe you can have them put their email in, or if they interact, once they interact with your chat bot, okay, then they become a subscriber onto your chat onto your like many chat platform, right? And once they're a subscriber, you have the ability to send them messages whenever you want until they decide to leave, right? Which they can at some point, they have to enter, like I forget, it's just like if they say stop, they'll be unsubscribed from the bot, okay? But this is this is key, this is, this is powerful stuff here. So if you are still here, guys, if you are still here on this video, make sure you go down and drop a like because this is big, this is big. So what you can do is now you can use that, that chat bot to ask questions and so you can give them 
three or whatever different options, okay? So you can have them, hey, how's it going, blah, blah, blah. You know, you're interested in this. You know, you want to get my free offer, my free bonus. You can have all these different things where they can go through and click on these different things and then go to different pages. You can send them different messages depending on their answers, all this amazing stuff. And so now what you can literally come in and do is, is ask them their questions, ask them what they're having trouble with. And then when you ask them what they're having trouble with, maybe you could have different affiliate products based off of different answers, which is this is big. So now you can have this product for somebody who is looking for like mentorship and you can say, oh, well, you know, I have a service here. Uh, I recommend this and if you're an affiliate for that, for that service or whatever, maybe someone needs email marketing. Hey, I, you know, I have get response for you right here. And maybe someone, you know, just wants a quick, you know, like cheap product that they can get like a, like a little like ebook or something that they, that'll get them going on the right track to whatever it is they want to learn. Hey, you know, here, here's this you know, ebook that I have from Amazon. It's your Amazon affiliate link. Boom, boom, just like that. And, and, and you're monetizing that three different ways, you know, based off of the answers that someone's providing, because you don't know what everyone's going to have. Everyone's going to have different needs, desires, and it's going to be in different place. And so that's where that comes in. So hopefully that makes sense. And if that did, guys, make sure you go down and leave this video a thumbs up, as well as check out my affiliate marketing playlist. I've got two of them. One's like massive. One has like all my affiliate marketing videos. One has just my seven affiliate marketing video training. Check those, those out if you guys want to learn more about affiliate marketing. And with that being said, guys, subscribe to the channel for daily videos. I'm posting here every single day. And let me know if you want to see more videos with the whiteboard just like this because I think it's pretty cool. I like it. So I'm going to keep doing it until people say, hey, we hate this stuff. So that being said, guys, I'll see you in tomorrow's video. Peace.